The Samoan lineup has been announced for their opening Rugby World Cup fixture up against Chile. It should be an entertaining game. And Samoa, in such a tough group of Paul D, need to make sure that they're starting off their competition with a win. And with the lineup that they've gone with, they certainly have their potential. Looking through at the starting side, it is number one, James Lane, number two, Salala Lamb, and number three, the captain. Michael Alaratoa, so something similar to what we have seen throughout the Pacific Nations Cup. Also, we need to remember the last game that we saw the Samoans in action. It was up against Ireland, where they were almost able to pull off that massive upset in the lock and duo. It will be Chris Vui at number four with Theo McFarlane coming in as the number five. It is the stock standard combination that we have seen from Samoa. In 2023, in the loose board trail, it will be Talini Su. And number six, number seven, Fritz Lee. And then number eight, Stephen Luatua. Now, there were question marks of whereabouts Luatua would slot into this Rugby World Cup squad in terms of that loose forward trio. And for now, it does seem like he will be the number eight. Looking through at the back line, number nine, Jonathan Tamatene started off the Pacific Nations Cup with a bang, charging down the Japanese kick and managing to score himself the first try of 2023. For the Samoans, number 10, they have gone with Christian Leliofano. Now, it was going to be between him and Lima Sopawanga. I did pick that Leliofano would get the nod here. And that is exactly what they have done. He has got a high kicking percentage, which will be important, getting as many points as physically possible for Samoa in their opener. And then they've got Sopawanga to come off the bench later on in the game and also bring that X Factor out on the left wing. It is Nigel Wong. In the centres, it will be Tamua Manu at number 12 and number 13, Ben Olipano Jr. Seltini out on the right wing. They've gone with Danny Tawala. That is rather than Ed Fidel, who will instead be coming off the bench. And then at number 15 to close out the starting side for Samoa, it is Duncan Paiaua. But that is their starting lineup. Now looking through at the reserves. Now later on in this game, I believe that is where Samoa will start to have more of an advantage seeing as they are a relatively fit side and they were able to go deep into the waters up against the Irish. So they'll want to do Exactly that here as well. Number 16, it is Summer Malolo. Number 17, Jordan Lay. And number 18, Paul Alo Amili. Then the rest of the replacement forward, Sam Slade. And number 19, and then number 20, the dangerous Jordan Talfour. The benefit that they've got with him is he can slot into anywhere in their loose forward trio. Will play it very well. Also, you've got that option of switching Luatua to maybe six. Then having Talfour coming off the back of the scrums. Number 21, Iritara Inari, 22 Lima Sopawanga, and number 23. Like I mentioned a bit earlier on, it is Ed Fidel. But the first game for the Samoans of the Rugby World Cup, it will be taking place at 1 a.m. New Zealand time on Sunday morning. So be sure to check that out. We will be doing the live commentary on the channel as well. So do keep an eye out for that. They're up against a strong Chile side that did start their match up against Japan. Not too badly. It was just in the later stages that fatigue started to set in. But I will certainly be looking out for Marcelo Torrilba. He was a fantastic player in round one of the Rugby World Cup. That was for Chile. Watch him in the number nine jersey. Because he should certainly be able to have an impact. But thank you all very much for tuning in. Do let me know what you think of the starting side in the comments down below. I believe overall it is actually relatively similar to what I wanted to see. As a Samoan starting XV for this Rugby World Cup. I believe the only real change that I had in that starting side was probably Danny Tawala. At 14, instead I did have Ed Fidel starting, but Tawala and Fidel both still in the side, both rearing a go for this World Cup. But thank you all very much for tuning in. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all for the next one.